Hey, what's going on guys and welcome back to some more Minecraft Dragons But before we get into the video I just wanted to remind you guys that we have the competition running for you to design your very own dragon and get it added to Dragonfire the mod that is right, we will be choosing a winner next week, so if you haven't entered, guys, be sure to do so. The link to the Patreon and everything you need is down below in the description. You just have to be a supporter of the middle tier plus and leave a email to the email address with the template below. So your dragon design, your dragon egg design if you want, and your Patreon name and the dragon name, and we will be choosing a winner very very soon i wish you all the best of luck whoever has entered and yeah guys enjoy the video hey what's going on guys and welcome back to some more minecraft dragons with me tiny turtle and scuba steve we're back in the myth nation it's been a couple of days since we've been uh been here and uh, been looking after the dragons so i'm guessing there's going to be some dragons to feed but oh oh remember the myth dragon was injured i forgot about Ooh. that so i want to go check with nurse emma see how um see how he is let's go feed dragula where is he dragula's not here check the roof check the roof oh i fell in the blood i'm in the blood no no where where which one these go right down these yeah. are pretty deep yeah, that one? Yeah. yeah. I'm good now. Yeah, okay. Uh, get out of there! Immediately I fell That's in. That's so gross. You're gonna need a shower. Okay. Yep. Let's see. Uh, Dragula's not here. I don't know where Dragula is. Um, okay. We've got... Oh, let's go feed our mummy dragon. Ooh. Oh! Oh! We gotta choose a name. We almost forgot Momo. Scuba Steve. No, not, not from you. Not a name from you. It's a name from the people who left them in the comment section. We got to go choose one. And look, so hungry. It's my fault. It's been a few days. My bad. Here you go. Eat these pork okay. chops. Enjoy them. And one more should do it. Yeah. All right. Whoo. We got a lot of dragons to feed. You know what? Scuba Steve, you get feeding the dragons. Go around, check all of them. And I'll go and pick a name for our mummy dragon. Because you guys left so many cool names. Uh, and I did see a few that I really liked. I just need to go remember who said them. So I'm going to go pick them. And uh, let's, let's do it. All right, guys. We have got the name. So we are going to call this mummy dragon Sandy. Oh, it makes sense. Because I of like, all the sand. I like Sandy. There were some other cool names. Uh, we saw Mumula, uh, Sandstorm. Momo. Was, uh, Momo, of course. There was a few cool names, but we decided to go with Sandy. And I think there was a couple of people who said Sandy. So well done to you guys. And uh, let's get moving. I want to find Dragula. I don't know where Dragula is. And I don't uh, understand. Yeah. It's kind of... strange that he's not in his like cave. Is that what it is? Yeah, it is, it is in his lair. Lair, yeah, definitely a lair. It, oh, wait, I'm going to go check on the Myth Dragon. Let's check with Nurse Emma, see, what, see what's up, see what happened. Uh, because it is very, very rare for a Myth Dragon to be yep. unwell. And don't worry, guys, we know we need to deal with Clog and the Dragon Council as well. We'll have to get that sorted. But Nurse Emma, what happened? How is the Myth Dragon doing? He's still, he's still down. I have examined this myth dragon very carefully for illnesses, but it wasn't until I did a physical examination that I noticed some bite marks around its neck. Now, these guys have tough armor like you know, so that saved him, but I'm pretty sure it must have been that vampire dragon of yours. It must be hungry. What? what? No. Uh, so it didn't actually pierce through the myth dragon. Uh, his armor saved him. Nah, that didn't happen. That's, that can't... Why are we trying to do that? She said, we must find him quickly. Who knows what could happen if he doesn't get what he needs. He must be looking for blood. But, I mean, there's... We left blood in his... Lair for him to drink. Because we know he drinks blood. But maybe he yeah. likes to hunt the blood? Now, listen, come here. I, I... Listen up, okay? I like Norse Emma. As much as everyone else likes Norse Emma. But yeah. She's kind of cooped in there all day. What does she really know about going around and finding new species of dragons and stuff like that? She doesn't really know much about that. So uh, I think she's kind of talking a bit crazy because maybe she's just bored or something. No, she doesn't know much about that. But she does know about illnesses and injuries. And she said it's bite marks around uh, the neck. So that leads me to believe it is probably 
Dragula, but I don't know where Dragula is, so... Okay, Hang let's on. go searching around. Let's go searching around. Hang on, look, 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 look. Look, look up. Up, up, up at the life here he up came in the sky. something. Oh. <gasps> Uh-oh. Oh, oh no. Is that... Is that blood? Don't look too good. Go, go, go! <gasps> oh, Dragula's here! Dra no! What, oh, what do you mean Dragula's no. there? Oh, Dragula, get in. Whew! I got Dragula, but... Life here is not doing too good. He must have bit her. Oh, okay. okay. Okay, I take back everything I said about Nurse Emma. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go get Nurse Emma really, really quickly. See if we can make sure she's okay. Uh, this I'll is stay really here with bad. her. Why is Dragula doing that? He had a supply of food up there. Um, okay. Nurse Emma! Nurse Emma! You've got to go up to the Light Fury ca cave quickly. We found Dragula standing over the Light Fury's body. I think... I think she's been bit. So, Nurse Emma, uh, how is she? Is she okay? She's alive, but barely. I'll have to treat her here. Make sure you keep Dragula in that orb until you figure out why he is attacking the other dragons. Of course, of course, I won't be letting him out at all. Uh, we need to figure this out. Okay. Okay, I hope she does well. Scuba Steve. Um, sorry for not believing in you. Sorry. Yeah, you've got to believe in Nurse Emma. She's always healing all the dragons. Uh, oh, let me off. Um, right. Dragula is attacking other dragons. And he's a vampire dragon, and he wants blood. But he has blood, so why is he attacking other dragons? Hmm. Um, I think maybe you made a really good point earlier when you said... Maybe he's in it for the hunt. Maybe him just getting blood given to him yeah. isn't enough. He needs to get out there and feel like he's a proper alpha male dragon thing. And just wants to get out there and just, I don't know, attack some other dragons, which is very scary. Yeah, or maybe, maybe he does need blood, but maybe he needs it from a live source. Ooh, yeah. Okay, that makes sense too. Because mm. um, that'll just be cold. Maybe he likes warm makes, blood. This all makes a lot of sense. Yeah. But we just could be going around in circles. These could all... I, you know me. I enjoy uh, I enjoys me a conspiracy theory. But we don't know the facts. So yeah. we need to go somewhere where we can get all the facts. Oh, we could go back to the vampire. The old guy. Um, where we got Dragula. And see, because he obviously was feeding him for a long time. We should really go and check it out. Yeah, but see, now I'm scared again. Yeah, you were scared, weren't you? Well, just stay behind me. He seemed like a nice person. Just uh, misunderstood. From, mm -hmm. you know, all the like token and stuff. Yeah, that'll do it. So, okay, okay I can't fly Dragula, so I'm not going to take him. Um, I can't take the Light Fury. Uh, I'm going to go get Pyro or, or Spark. And let's head off to the Darklands and go to uh, see this, uh, this vampire. See if he has any info for us. Yeah, let's do it. Oh, look at this, Scuba Steve. It's all open. There's no no trespassing signs. This was all barricaded up before. Maybe yeah. maybe he's gone. Do you think he's gone? That would be bad. I, I don't think he's gone. Maybe he's just loosened up his security a little bit because he's not as afraid because we have Dragula now. You know, I think he was kind of afraid that yeah. Dragula would get out more so than people would break in. Look, there's no guards around. There are no guards around. He did say he was going to go and travel a bit before... Uh, before he got too old, so he could be gone. I hope not. Uh, hello? Hello? I'm gonna check around. Yeah, let's have a look around. Let's have a little a little snoop. Because we didn't I didn't get a proper look at every room. Yeah, no fish. I kinda we did have a bit of a look around when we were looking for the keys. Yeah. But but... I don't know where this guy is. He's like a lot of food here now just for one person. That's pretty insane. I'm gonna go upstairs. Ooh, okay. Yeah, you go upstairs. I'll check downstairs. Um, yeah. Uh, oh, this was... Yeah, we we didn't really ask many questions about this guy. He does have a cell here with a lot of skeletons in it and beds. Uh, I don't think we want to ask any questions. New. Don't no. we want to know exactly what he does? He, he kind of seems like the type of guy that's like, Oh, yeah, sure, I can tell you, but I'd have to kill you. Yeah, and so. he has, like, loads of TNT. It's, oh, yeah. he's definitely up to no good, I, but I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Uh, hello, it's just us again. Is he around? I can't see anything. I'm upstairs and I can't see no. anything. Um, Ooh. there was only really, where else? Oh, outside maybe? No, oh, these snails. I forgot about these slugs. No, not out here. Oh, what about underground? Oh, yeah, okay. That was up here, wasn't it? Yes, sir. It was. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. Remember we had the, hey, the door's open. You could be right. Could be 
in here. He could be waiting for us. Hello. Maybe he's expecting us. Don't want to scare anybody. He's over Hello. there. Hello. He's over there. Oh, he is. Uh, uh. Hello. Excuse me. Excuse me, Senor Vampire. Uh, we have a bit of an issue. Um, Dragula, as you know, the, the vampire dragon, has been attacking other dragons, trying to eat their blood, but we don't understand because we give him a constant supply of blood, just like you did here. Uh, do you have any suggestions for us? Oh yes, you must feed him livestock every now and then to quench the thirst for live warm blood. If you don't, he will seek it himself. I usually just used a few cows every few weeks and then you have no problems. At first, I didn't know what was going on. He kept trying to eat me as, and I was the only one around. Ooh, yeah, okay. Ooh, that's pretty crazy. All right, that would have been good to know before. Anyway, it, yeah, that's fine. What are you doing down here alone? Oh, I just miss him is all. I plan on leaving this place soon, but sometimes I like to come down here where he stayed. It cheers me up. Ah, oh, uh, that's, that's nice. Kind of, that's kind of sad. And sad. I mean, yeah. Nice and sad, but livestock. Okay. I, th I thought it could have been the issue, but uh, thank you. Okay. I guess we'll just get out of here. But, yeah, um, it's getting a bit weird. Cows. We could just use cows every few weeks. Yeah, we, I mean, we don't really have a farm, but we should get one. We should, yeah, we should definitely work on the area. Make it a little bit more uh, dragon friendly. I mean, we need fishing boats. We need farms. We need all that kind of good stuff because we have so much that we need to do to feed these dragons. Um, so I guess, yeah, let's go get a little cow farm. Maybe put it up near Dragula so that he stays around that area. Yeah, that sounds good. I mean, you don't want him going off having a hunt. Because imagine he goes off and there's no cows around and he goes onto some poor farmer's farm and then the farmer ends up being eaten with all his cows. Yeah, that would be bad news and we would be liable. And yeah, you never know some... what would happen with this new council. And we need to figure that out because I don't trust them one bit and neither does his own orc people. So we uh, definitely need to get on that case. But right now, let's get back to the nation and let's uh, figure out. Let's get some cows and see if we can fix Dragula's problem. And hopefully the life fury will be okay. All right, we're back. Now, I don't want to let Dragula out yet. I want to make sure there are a few little cows around first. So I'm thinking we could do like a, a little mini farm here. I got some fences, but I don't know if it's going to be enough. Uh, we probably will need to get some more, but Scuba Steve, what do you think? We could do a cool farm system here, right? We could really work it out so that it, it lets, like, one animal into Dragula's cave every now and then. But it, it just kind of repopulates itself, and it's kind of multi-level tier farm Dragula uh, eating system. Yeah, I think that sounds good, and the name needs a little bit of work. It's, uh, it's, it, it sounds complicated, it, doesn't it? It does sound complicated, but I like that it's here. You know, I think if you put Dragula out and he, he could just see that there was cows there for him, yeah. it would just make him feel at ease. I think maybe he was just getting a little bit antsy in his dragon pantsy. Yeah, we can't have him attacking other dragons like that at all. So. Or us. Yeah, oh, we did say he tried to eat people, so if we were closest... Ooh, I had two I'm... fences left over. That's nice. People. You're a people. You're a, but you're a, you would taste like rubber. Yes, I would. This is true. That's not very nice. Although a shark, yeah. a shark would probably eat you. All right. There we go. We've got a little fence gate. We've got a little fence. Let's clear this up. And let's get some cows in here. I think this the bottom floor should be for cows. And oh, do you have a shovel or anything on you? I got a shovel, but where are we going to get us some cows? Uh, we should be able to get cows easy enough. There's a lot around. There's a lot of space around us. We could go lead them up and, uh, oh, I wonder if we could put them on a lead. And hey, here, you want this? Like, fly them back here would be funny. Uh, there you go. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So this is what I'm thinking. If we come up with some sort of cool system that funnels cows in with water. Oh, yeah, that'd be cool. Now and then. I don't know. It's going to be tough, but it would be fun. Like some them. dispensers or something and got them to shoot them out. Although that probably just shoot them out of spawn eggs. We need to think of this properly. Yeah, we do, we do, we do. But this is this is a little tunnel anyway, and I want to be able to see it. So I want to get want to get glass on every side, and yeah, this could be really fun if we design it right. A little feeding system for Dragula. 
All right, let's... Oh, no, I was going to say let's troll Dragula out, but all we have is fences. Dragula isn't looking for fences. He's looking for cows. Yeah, he's not going to quench his bloodthirst with biting fences. No, fences. chewing on That's some like, wood? No, I don't think so. That ain't going to work. I've mm. tried that before. It's not tasty. But not yeah, no, I, I think we're making, we're making good progress here. Yeah, I think definitely a cool farm system here feeds things in through here. And then we'll... You, you know what? If we block them in in here that Dragula can only get into them and uh, he knows where to go for his live food and his cold food I mean we like warm food and cold food as well we don't only stick to cold food so uh, it makes sense yeah exactly Ish. I mean if you had cold soup <laughs> hmm yeah well you can yeah I mean it's nice but sometimes I like warm soup yeah it's like a salad or do you want some pasta well either way yeah. you want you can have them cold all right, well, uh, let's get working on that, Scuba Steve. Let's go uh, find some cows and let's start designing up. I'm going to start sketching up ideas for this feeding system over here and see what happens. And then we'll go and check if Nurse Emma needs anything for medicine for the Life Fury. Uh, so we've got a busy day ahead of us. So are you ready to do that? Don't die. Ooh, did you die? Yeah, I'm indeed. Ooh. All right. Perfect. Well, guys, thank you so much for watching. We've got a lot of work to do. Be sure to tune in tomorrow. We'll be back with more Minecraft dragons. Of course, if you want to enter the competition to design your own dragon, all of the info is down below in the description. All you have to do is be a member of the Patreon and draw your dragons and submit them via email. But guys, we'll be picking a winner next week. I hope you do uh, enjoy the videos and I wish you luck if you do enter the competition. But guys, until tomorrow, bye. Bye, guys.